to the second part of the class. From the little we have just read, we have read that one night Sunday was evil in reputation. According to how the author described him, he has never had a, a, a good penny in all his life. All his life is mass, all his life is full of evil. Is evil in reputation? Is evil in appearance? His appearance was evil. His body was huge. His head was very small and flattened like an head, according to how he was described in our recommended test. He lost one of his eyes to a fight. No wonder Calabar mothers use it to give a warning to their children not to be like one eye Sunday. Calabar fathers also threaten their children. Hope you will not end up like one eye Sunday. That's the personality of one eye Sunday. But that day, that he paid a visit to Mr. Vasse's house. It was dressed neatly to the extent that the children were wondering whether he has smuggled a particular shop to get all those items he was putting on. The passage is well read, and the children and students can immediately get what the passage is talking about. Let's proceed to the, the other aspect of our reading. One night Sundays near Homely. One night Sundays near Homely. And how profitable is it to be an honest fisherman? How would you like to have 20 old naira hunted out into your hands for every voyage you make by Kelo? Voyage in that context means a three. Voyage. It was one night Sunday that I was talking to Mr. Bassi, the fisherman. How would you like to have 20 home naira? Cut it out into your hands for every voyage you make by Kelo. Promise to join us. Take a vote of loyalty. And your troubles are finished for the rest of your life. One night Sunday was trying to cajole Mr. Bassi to accept their offer. Was trying to tell him that if he could take their offer, he would not suffer for the rest of his life. They begin when the custom officers catch the kingdom and be retorting Basi. Get off my compound before I set the dog on you. I'm sure the police will be very pleased when I tell them what you have said. They are offering rewards for information about the smuggling business. We all know what smuggling means. When you force in illegal goods into a particular country, that is smuggling. One who partake of smuggling is called a smuggler. A smuggler. The police is it? Well, we'll see who gets arrested. The sun was barely up on Monday morning. Before a loud and authoritative knocking was heard on Bassey's door. Full stop. Four police constables and a sergeant marched inside as soon as Udo had opened the door and quickly began to search the house. They started searching Mr. Bassey's house because he declined their offer. They wanted to put him into trouble because he has known their secrets. 
That was why they secretly buried something in his compound, unaware to his passing. See this paper? It's a search warrant. We have reason to believe that you are concealing smuggled goods somewhere on this premises. Because they declined their offer, they came when nobody was around and planted some whiskey in Mr. Bassey's compound to implicate him. Come and see what we have found underneath the fishing net. Come and see what we have found underneath the fishing net. Sergeant, four cartons of contraband cigarettes. Four cartons of contraband cigarettes and a crate of whiskey. Take him away, man! Take him away! Because he rejected their offer, they implicated him. They implicated him and took him away. They took him away. Ahmad could not understand most of what was said in the court, but he did. Here yeah, his father say not guilty. Not guilty. Finally, the magistrate said case adjourned on the 25th of April, accused to be remanded in custody. Bail is refused. Accused is someone that is wrongfully implicated or for a certain offense. Accused to be remanded in custody, bail is refused. They do not allow them to pay for Mr. Bassey's bail. Like I told you when we started, that this an extra from Rosemary Webedimo, Akman and the Smugglers, published by African University Press. Now, let's go to the explanation for the second part of the passage. When they, when one night Sunday finally made himself into Mr. Bassey's compound, the children, Udo and Akma, they were frightened. They were frightened. And when one night Sunday woke up to them, he told them that he wanted to see their father. And when he finally met the father, he discussed the reason why he was in his compound. They wanted to recruit him into his into their smuggling uh, carcass. But Mr. Bassey, being an honest man, rejected the offer. Despite the fact that one night Sunday cajoled him that he would not suffer for the rest of his life again, but he refused. He rejected the offer. To punish him for that refusal, they had to plant whiskey, contraband whiskey, in his compound. And as a result of that, they now finally arrest him. Finally arrest him. And when Mr. Bassi got to the court, he pleaded not guilty. And the case was adjourned until April 26th. And the accused is to be in police custody. They rejected his bail to show the, 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 the Strong, the strength of his offense. Hope you understand this passage. If you don't really understand this passage, you can still apply your reading techniques and quickly move over the passage and get the, uh, the idea behind the passage. Now, we are going to ask some questions on it. The first question says, who was one eye Sunday? Who was one eye Sunday? Class activity says. Says who was one eye Sunday? Who was one eye Sunday? The second one class have to say, how do you think he came by his name? Came by his name. Why the assignment? You attend where 
question 3 to 8 as your assignment. You attach question 3 to 8 as an assignment. You do it on your own the way you do it on a wire day. You have to do it very well as if your teacher is beside you. Do it very well. Once again, let's, let me quickly summarize the passage. It's about one night Sunday. Who has never had a, a penny? Who has never had a penny since he started in Islam? He, he lost one of his eyes during a fight. And that day that I approached Mr. Bass's compound, the children were making jest of him because they have never seen him dressed like that. Because he, his appearance is evil. He was evil in reputation. He has been remanded in police custody for manslaughter, for theft of various kind. I hope at the end of this lesson, you will quickly go back to the passage so that to get or to be able to comprehend the passage. Remember, our specific objective said, describe the personalities of one eye Sunday. He is equally the same as who was one eye Sunday. So we have treated it. And then we shall meet for the next class. God spares our lives. I encourage you to stay in your place so that we can be able to overcome this pandemic in the mighty name of Jesus.